Now, I'm just going to go through a, a scripture quickly. And I just want you to listen quickly because when a word normally comes, the Lord normally uses the word to shift the environment. Amen? Also, Sister Shakira put you in some trouble too. Because, you know, when I was coming, the Lord said, We're going to honor, we go choose a night, we're going on a night pass. That same pass before, and she didn't know. Amen? All of you just continue to listen to the Lord. Amen? So we're going on a night fast, you know, to break some stuff and shut some out of the enemy. From 6 Tuesday till 6 in the morning, Wednesday morning. So you're not going to eat after 6. You can do it, right? So we're going on it. Amen? We just thank the Lord for Sister Pat. Deacon has Pat. She come back. Amen? Amen. God. Amen. It was okay. I know you was fearful, but you have been through the operation and come back, right? And God gonna bless you. Amen. Amen. I know a lot of people afraid of operation would, but Jesus will take it through. Amen. Amen. So we just want to thank the Lord. Everybody just said change. change. That's what I heard this morning. I heard loud and clear change. Amen. So we're gonna look on change and we're gonna look on the scripture quickly. But the Lord is saying, and just declare the change on your life and believe that change is going to come. Now, Daniel 7, back into the very Daniel, amen? That is scripture, verse 21. Everybody know about Daniel, that Daniel was um, a vice president. He was equivalent to a vice president. He was equivalent to what the vice president named presently? Biden. So Daniel would be like Biden, Amen? You read it carefully. Um, they used to have more than one vice president those time, about four or so. If you look on the scripture. But, you know, Daniel was righteous and he didn't allow corruption or anything to change his view. He didn't allow the world view to change his view as a political leader. We have seen now people, you know, that is walking in darkness and we have seen leaders are complimenting them. When they are walking in, in darkness instead of light. And we have seen politicians you now have turned to immorality and different stuff because they are fearful. But here this man who is a vice president of the nation. He didn't bow. He didn't afraid to pray. Hallelujah. It, you know, is that even when all the politicians come together that they're going to get rid of him. He still decides to pray three days, not going to give up. Amen. So even when they throw him in the lion den under the exact scripture, he decide that he know his God. That the very king, you know, sometimes people will go to a leader because they can't get rid of you. So because they can't get rid of you because the God that you serve and the righteousness that you take, they will implement laws. But the laws that they are implementing, you can do one or two people that they are targeting. So they implement the laws and said, X, Y, Z, D, if anybody pray to, to, you know, to any different God or what petition, what they would do. But Daniel, you know, know the power of prayer. And the power, everybody said, the power of prayer. Change. The power of prayer overturn and it shut the lion's mouth. It doesn't matter what is coming against you. Amen. The main fact that the Lord will Lord give me that scripture against this is Shakira. He said, the Holy Spirit can speak. And he would say, go choose there. We're going for all of you. It doesn't matter. Every single one of you know. Whatever coming, whatever situation, the God going to shut some stuff. But he didn't bow. He decides. So even when they go to the king, the king love him. And they tell the king all kind of stuff. You know, sometimes, you know, people go to the boss who love you. But because the part, a boss doesn't want to offend anybody politically, even within his heart, he know that you're a good worker. He know that you're a good person. But he doesn't want to offend anyone. And because the laws and the jargons that they would use and the definition, and, the, you know, they would present before him and say, oh, king, you know, you already, you know, you know the laws and the meats and the Persian already, you know, your, your seal must go to this. You cannot come against it. But still, if you read it, the king believe in the God that Daniel served. He may not believe serve that God, but he have seen 
the power of the God that Daniel served already. So the king said, you know, you know, I'm sorry you know, for what I've done. You know, I've done Daniel wrong, but because I, you know, I doesn't want politically for you know to lose the presidency or whatever boss. You know, I'm just going to let it go through. But when they throw Daniel in the lion den, you know, hmm, understand, it is the king himself who went on that night fast. If you realize the king went on that night fast to pray for Daniel itself. So I here to tell you that the enemy may go to people at times to come against you, but that same person who they go to is praying that your faith will never fail. Everybody say hallelujah. Everybody say amen. Everybody say hallelujah. Now, what the enemy don't understand is that the very lion is God made that. The very teeth within the lion mouth is God made that. Everybody understand that? It doesn't matter. The enemy don't understand. This man was looking at something. The very fish that is in the sea is God made it. The very economy. Amen? Is God made it. So God made man. And God made man to be one thing that they will connect to God only. If we connect to any other God, there is going to be other stuff. And that's why God calling his people to turn back. So don't worry when you're in your, dying, your land then. You're going to go in your land then. The very king is going to pray for you and you're going to come out promoted. But when you come out promoted, not one of your enemy will be spared. Amen, amen. You know, you know, you know what the Lord showed me this man? Everybody say change. change. The very Daniel, there's a appointed time that God has to bless us. So God will allow you to go through the lands then. He will allow you to go through the valley. But when the Lord says time, no one can stand in your way. Amen. So let's look at this scripture. Hallelujah. Let's look at this scripture because there's some stuff is about to change. Everybody said things about to change. In your position. Now, Daniel 7 verse 21 said, Behold, the same on made war with the saint. Each time you see on, it speaks about power, it speaks about ruler, and it speaks about authority. And then you see on in the Bible. Because Daniel and Revelation is very difficult to understand. You have to understand what the symbol means when you say on, when you say crown, that's speaking about power and authority. So it's a beheld. And that same on made war with the saint and prevail against them. Amen? Until the ancients of days come. Everybody say until. until. The ancients of days came. And judgment was given to the saint of the most high. And the time came that the saint possessed the kingdom. Everybody said possess. There are times that God will allow the enemy to afflict you. He will allow the enemy to ride you. He will allow the enemy to do all the injustice against you. It's me said that or the Bible said that. Yes. He will allow the enemy. Have you ever feel as a Christian as if we are losing the battle? Everybody is coming out from the closet. And you are wondering, you know, on the entire news of it. And you are wondering where is Christian? Are Christian not coming out of the closet? Everybody understand that? Are you wondering, God, what is happening? What is happening to the body of Christ? Everybody is just rising. And it seems as if Christianity is dead. And it seems as if nothing is happening. And why all the injustice is happening to us. We're losing our job. They're taking away our house. They're treating us all the kind of way while the wicked enjoying all the blessings. And we as God's servant, the saint, is suffering. Everybody ever feel that? And you want to give up. And sometimes the enemy would whisper into your ears. And he would say, guess what? Your God that you serve, you know, cannot help you. Is he really real? Is the God that you serve really coming true for you? Everybody understand that? Yes, we all, we've been through that. Why the wicked? But the Bible said, until, everybody say until. until. The ancients of days came and judgment was given to the saint of the most high. And the time came that the saint possessed the kingdom. Everybody say possessed the kingdom. 
So when you see the Asians of this, who is, who is the Asians of this? Jesus. Everybody, who is the Asians of this? So it's like Jesus would just sit in his chair and say, all right, let us go and persecute my people. He just sit and everything's happening and Jesus just watching, watching, watching. He's the ancient of days. And man becoming wicked and everything does going A, Y, Z. But when Jesus sit up, amen, everything has to subject to your God. Everybody understand that? So it's, the, the, the Bible said, verse 23, it said, let's look at verse 20. Yeah, 23, it said, thus he said, the fourth beast shall be the fourth kingdom upon earth and shall be diverse from all kingdoms. And shall devour the whole earth and shall tread it down and break it in pieces. What happened is that there is a force of darkness right now within nations that is rising. And even the, the world leaders are coming together and they are putting plans. You know, that you know, we're gonna get rid of Christianity. And we go, we don't want it. Even this week on the television, you see where they say they're gonna court martial the soldiers now if they find them with a Bible. You know, I've prophesied inside here that the very shortly, well, who was here? That very shortly, you're going to say you can't have Bible in the force. Now you can't have Bible in the prison. Now you can't buy Bible in the army. Yes, it's it now become reality. But God of a time, amen, when God will say, I will allow you to continue, but I have my time, then I'm going to say it's my time. Everybody says my time. My time. He said the ten horns of the kingdom, some says the ten nations. Going to come together. Verse 24. And ten kings shall arise, and another shall rise after them. And he shall be dive, diverse from the first, and he shall subdue these three kings. Something is about to happen. Globally. This is a prophetic word. It is either who is about to enter into a war, but something is about to happen. And, and God going to allow it to happen. And in the midst of what is about to happen, Christianity going to rise. Everybody understand? Amen. No, it said, Amen. It said in this is that, and he shall speak great word against the most high and shall wear out the saint of the most high. And think to change times and laws. Everybody say change time and laws. And he shall be given into his hand until the time. And the time and the dividing of time. But judgment shall sit, and they shall take away his dominion. To consume and destroy it unto the end. It's very important now. Verse 27. And the kingdom and dominion and the greatness of the kingdom under the whole heaven shall be given to the people of the saints. Shall be given unto who? Verse 30 said, and everybody repeat after me. And the kingdom, and, the kingdom. And, dominion. and dominion and the greatness of the kingdom under the whole heaven shall be given to the people of the saint, the most high, whose kingdom is the everlasting kingdom. And all dominion shall, shall serve and obey him. Now, what, what, what he's saying is that some of you have been going through some stuff, but God said there is a decree that has no made and this decree that I've now made is about to allow the saint. You're about to receive favor. You're about to rise up. Some of you are going to wonder what just got. You know, it was down now. It seems like everything just changed overnight. Amen? Some of you are going to wonder what happened. Because guess what? You wonder what is happening. You know, how things just become so easy. Some of you are going to become suspicious. Uh -huh. Some of you are going to get apology. Some of you are going to get a phone call. You're going to see things just start to change. And you start to say, what just happened? Amen. Uh -huh. So everybody say change. change. So one of the things that the Lord is saying to encourage you. The time come for the saint to take dominion and possess. The time for his people to reinstate. That is where the Lord says, everybody say reinstate. With power. power. Normally when they use the word reinstate, anybody have a fire yet? And you get a letter or a suspend you and say you are reinstated. Uh, everybody understand? <laughs> Hallelujah. Amen. It could be relationship also.
because you can't get fire in relationship, then, true? It could be some stuff taken away from you. Of course, people get fired. I counsel them every day. Man say, you're fired, I don't want you. Amen. That's how you go? But when the time change, amen, they call them on the phone. I want, can I come over? Amen. I'm just thinking about you. Amen. They want to be reinstated. That's how you go? So there's some stuff that we have lost to that going to reinstate. Everybody say reinstate. Everybody say reinstate. There are some wrong that was done to you that you're about to be reinstated. Everybody say hallelujah. Not just you're going to reinstate, just reinstate, but you're going to reinstate with power. Do you believe that? And you're going to reinstate with more, like what Sister Debbie said. Because there, there's a law you have to understand that everything the enemy rob you, if he rob you one, the, the Romans and the Levitical laws, them say you have to get back three or four. Amen? So anything the enemy rob you, he has to pay you, which you call repentance first. And then you must be restored and restitution. Amen? Not just them you're going to say sorry, but you must be restored, restitution, for what you have been robbed. Everybody say hallelujah. It's a restoration. Everybody say restoration. Everybody say restoration. Everybody say restoration. Everybody say restoration. If the enemy touch your health, God going to restore you. A restore mean farmer. It's going to better. Everybody say hallelujah. If the enemy take away your car, you're going to get cars. If he take away your house, you're going to get houses. That's how you go. Restoration. Amen. Amen. Everybody say hallelujah. hallelujah. If your husband walk out. Amen. And divorce you. You're going to get a proposal. All three of them are going to come. You're going to wonder, Apostle, which one do I take? Hallelujah. That's what I heard. Amen. So guess what? The time for his people to reinstate with power. When judgment is made in the favor of the saint. Victory upon victory. Everybody say victory upon victory. So you're going to go through a season of victory. And don't worry if tomorrow a little lion try to bite after you. you. Don't have no teeth. Don't get worried. Amen? Because one thing the enemy always do is try to frighten us. Now say go. Amen, 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 amen. So guess what? So you're going to be victory upon victory. Amen? The time of defeat are over. Because there's a decree. Your adversary, amen, is about to bite the dust. Amen? God is about to lift you up, and you're about to seal, seize, everybody says seize, seize, the realm of control. We are, we, we're going to take away the realm that the enemy into. It's our time now. Everybody says it's our time now. It's our time now. Understand? Amen? It's time has come, amen, for us to tear down evil. That is why the Lord called these people to rise up and don't just cry. We don't need no cry, cry baby in the body of Christ. It's used to say cry, cry baby. Moonshine, darling, take off your, yeah? Amen. We need people to declare, open your mouth as a saint. That is what the Lord has said. What belong to you, belong to you. Everybody say hallelujah. If somebody in the workplace want to throw you out, you're going to stand up and say, I am not going, you are going. Amen. And if you rise up. And rise up too much as a saint because the decree is now for us. You have the authority to fire him. Amen. You can open your mouth and say you are fire. God wants his people to rise up now in the power and authority. We're tired of the cry cry baby. Amen. And guess what? If you are listening right now and somebody wants to take away your man. Amen. What I be a Jezebel. You have the power to fire Jezebel. Amen. I'm not gonna stand all alone on Jezebel. That's you. Amen. There's too much Christian in the body of Christ. They cannot get any maintenance while Jezebel get the money. Amen. That's why they make song. You have the man, me have the ring. Not you. But Jezebel, when this decree made, your time has expired, Jezebel. Hallelujah. Your time has expired. I'm a I hear the Lord said, I'm about to fire some Jezebel.
Everybody said, lift your hand, your right hand. Everybody lift your right hand and said, I have power. I have power. The realm belong to me. The work belong to me. Power belong to me. Change belong to me. Restoration belong to me. Healing belong to me. Restoration belong to me. I'm not gonna cry. It's my time. It's my time. It's my time. Our time. Our time. Our time. Come on. Our time. Our time. Amen. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Hear this. God said to tell you. If you're a single and God said the man belongs to you. And a Jezebel a hole on that man. That man has to let go. Hallelujah. Amen. There's some people. It's, it's your husband out there, not you? But they have been distracted. But because the decree has just made, there's a decree. Everyone says it's a decree. This decree is not coming from a man. It's coming from God. Who overrule every man. So I'm here to tell you that guess what? Your blessing has to let go. Come on, tell the devil. You have to let go. Because there's a decree. Come on, you have to let go. Come on. Let go your man. Amen. Let go your husband. Let go your children. Let go your job. Let go. Come on. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Let go. Let go. There's a decree. Jesus, when God gives me a word like this, I get excited because I know something is turning. Come on. Something is moving. Something is about to turn. Come on. Let go. Let go with blessing. Come on. Let go with blessing. Hallelujah. Let go with money. Let go with finance. Let it go. I decree. The money is mine. The job is mine. Favor is mine. Victory is mine. Hallelujah. The Bible said, I've never preached this message yet. Until the ancients of days came. And the judgment was given to the saint of the most high God. Who? Our Father is the most high God. Come on. It's the same God that blessed Abraham. Everybody say hallelujah. The most high God. Say hallelujah. Hold well, on. Now we said it's time for us to wrestle, to tear down evil, to overthrow the enemy. The enemy of a leave. Everybody say, I'm of a leave. When you go home this evening and say, enemy of a leave. Leave me back account. Leave me children. Leave me church. Leave me job. Because I serve the most high God. I don't serve Bial. I don't serve Bial. I don't go to Palm Reader. I serve the most I God! Hallelujah. Next thing. The time has come for us to place God. God is giving us power. Hold up your right hand and say power. power. The right hand is the power hand. Come on. He's giving you power. He's giving you a new power today. To overthrow demons. Overthrow them. It's time for you to open your mouth. Tired of the crying. Open your mouth. Amen. Open your mouth. You're going to decree. When God give us a word, he already back us up. Because the whole I got us speaking. We're not going to sit down. Allow the enemy to take our community. Take our children. Take the airwaves. We see media rising up, destroying the children. It's time for media to lock down. Come on. It's time for media to lock down any media pushing immorality destroying our children destroying our community it's time 
It's them. Come on. The enemy have to let go. Come on. Let go your children. Let go your parents. Let go your job. Come on. Let go. MC. So let go. 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 You're gonna let go. Let go with community. Let go with country. Let go the workplace. Let go. Let go. I hear the Lord said, between now and August, you're gonna see the change. Change in nation. Change in community. Change in family. Change. 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 I am tired. No more tears. No more tears, come on. It's time, everybody say it's time. I'm gonna rise. I'm not gonna let go. My God, decree, already. Believe, believe, believe. Everything is ours, come on. Come on, come on, I've seen Christian this week. He touched me. Guy teaching at the school and nobody know. I'm watching him from last week. And I said, oh, he looks so sad. He called us one side and he said, guess what? I'm a teacher, but I'm living, I'm homeless. I'm a Christian. Amen? Yes, Christian homeless. Because you see, because of injustice. Amen, Christian homeless. You know. But the Lord said, it's time. Everybody says it's time. It's, everybody says it's time. I'm about to lock down bank. Come on. I'm about to lock up manager. Come on. Change. 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 Come on. Change. Come on. Come on. He said, this is not the time. He's giving you power. We defeat the enemy by the blood of the lamb. By the word of our testimony. Testify in the morning. Testify in the evening. Because when you testify, something happen. Testify when you wake up. Testify to your children. So we defeat him with the blood of the lamb and the word of our testimony. Come on. Testimony. The time to declare the blood when you wake up. Blood in your house. Blood on the bus. Blood on the plane. Blood. Drink the blood. Come on. We're not going to come on. There's power in the blood. As Christian, we're not using the blood. Something happened with the blood. When she come in here, a dead person I see. That is why I call her. But when I start to sprinkle the blood, she's a sick here. Because something happened. Oh, the spirit of the blood, come on. The blood, come on. The blood, come on. The blood, come on. Heal it, sister Pat. The blood, blood, you heal. Not just, come on. Not just God fix you up. The Lord said, He's fixing you up. Not just that you get healing, but your husband come in too. And more children coming out of you. My son, so he's healed. So come on, rest your feet. Heal you up, come on. Lift up the blood, come on. The blood, come on. The blood, come on. I'm not gonna let go, come on. I'm not gonna let go. Where's the decree? Come on, let her worship, come on. Worship. Lift your hand, lift your hand. Lift your hand. There's a decree, come on. Let's worship our God, come on. Come, there's a decree, come on. You're not gonna sit down. The enemy not gonna roll you over anymore. You're gonna declare anything you want. The Lord said, declare it out of your mouth. We're not gonna have no soft heart for the enemy again. So if somebody are trouble you, declare out of your mouth. Me and you not stand for the job here. Two we can stay here. One of you leave, one of you go. Me not leave because I serve the most high God. Come on, I serve the Daniel God. I serve. The Daniel God. Come on. The Daniel God. Everybody say the Daniel God. The Daniel God. The Daniel God. The Daniel God. I'm not going to let go. Come on, hear this. Lord said, even when you feel weak, 
You must speak the word. Even when you feel weak, like you can't go. Declare the word of the Lord. Amen? Amen. Satan is a cast down. Everybody is a cast down. So, so lift your hand in your ear and say, Satan. Satan. You're a cast down. Satan is not in heaven. He is a shadow. God cast down that and kick out that long time. Amen, amen. That's falling. Come on. Cast, lift your hand in your ear and say, Satan. You're cast down. You cast them already? The Bible said, we're gonna kick you. We're gonna grind you. Come on. We're gonna cut by your neck. Come on, step on the enemy. Step on the enemy. Come on, come on, come on, step him. The Bible said, our heal is to crush the enemy. Come on, crush the enemy. Come on. Don't let the enemy come in. Come on, no more. Come on. Amen. He said, He said, we need the blood. The word of our testimony. It's decree already. Come on, say decree already. It's decree already. It's decree already. Now, listen, in this change, and listen quickly. Make sure you have the tape because you're going to see between now and August, you're going to see drastical and global change. Don't worry as a Christian. Once you're a Christian, you rejoice. Because what's going to take place, it's going to take place in the favor of you. So not, not trouble us when we hear. Amen? Because God speak it already. Bible says it's a lot of change going to take place. There's going to be a change of the God. Everybody say hallelujah. hallelujah. It's going to be secular, political, a lot of stuff going to happen. People are going to start the race and don't finish it. There's going to be, everybody say change of God. It's going to be change of God in the workplace. Everybody say hallelujah. hallelujah. It's a prophetic word. There's going to be change of God. Ensure that you have that on tape. That people can get. It's going to take place. We didn't know in August we're going to see drastic shift. That's going to take place. Change of God. Your variety is going to change. The Lord said things that you used to wear and eat and I don't want it anymore. God changing up some stuff. Amen. God even beautify you this season. Everybody, everybody see your sister Debbie beautify this man. She a flow. She a flow with God. Now say go. Say it's my time now. Say it's my time now. Come on. She's dressing for the success. She's dressing where she's going. It's my time now. Come on, say it's my time. Next change. We're going to see money and currency change globally. Money and currency change. What it means is that some of the change, some money is going to come into your hand. Don't worry. Money and currency change. But some change is going to come. System change. Everybody says system change. Laws, value. You're going to say laws and times. But all of these change are going to be in our favor. What God is about to do is going to revoke some stuff that was not in his favor and in for the benefit of his people. Amen. Everybody say amen. amen. There's gonna be policy change. Everybody say policy change. Policy change. Mind change, attitude change gonna take place. The market condition is gonna change, but it's a God people. And that is why God calling his people now to start to look. If you don't have the money for buy the house, find a house. Bring it on the altar, we pray. Start to declare. It's my house that. It's my house that. Everybody says it's my house that. Don't watch where the money coming from. Because God all normally moves with us by faith. Amen? It's my house that. Market condition going to change. God said the very way that we dress is going to change. Don't surprise if you see me coming out with my Miami Vice. That's what they call it. <laughs> don't know say don't know them, sir. Amen? The time when we have a real my big chain. Amen? We have to move with the time. Hallelujah. So it's going to be change. Everybody say change. change. The very here style is going to change. Nail change, every change. Amen. Because there's an ancient of day, which is God. They are change. And when God says change, we have to line up. Amen. Most time, when we are going through some stuff, the stuff that we are going through is a change to take place. Because Sometimes it's got to push us. 
into the path that you want us. We don't want to go easy because we don't like change. Nobody likes change. So we like routine. You know, you like the same thing every day and everything. But sometimes God has to disturb your comfort zone. That he can push you into where you want. Amen? So if you ever see people's hearts start get harder from where they are, and they must spit out more fire, it's got to push you into what he wants. Everybody say hallelujah. He said, sometime God change friends, and I hear that. Names, family, city, and job. Say it again. Sometimes God change friends, names, family, city, jobs. Because he know what best for us. Everybody understand that? Sometimes we're holding on to some stuff. And God has said, you know, we, those extra. He has bigger plan than us. Amen? Because sometimes we think small. But God is a big God. Amen? What you wouldn't want to buy for yourself is what God wants to give you. Because we know sometimes you go out there and look on some stuff. And you say, boy, this is too expensive. I don't have the money, so I'm not even look on it. But God has a plan for you. Amen? We must never get weary during a season of change. You know, Job was getting weary, say, when his friend them start telling him all kind of stuff. He said, the appointed time, because he know about time, you know. I'm going to wait till my change come. He know, because God control time, God control season. That's why I don't worry. I just want to know, is my time or my season? When God says, my time or my season, you better come out of the way. Amen? Because if you don't come out, we're going to run you down. That's how you go. Everybody say hallelujah. There was a bank. You know, you go to the bank, them, and when you go to the bank, them, and change the policy on you. And then start drawing $10 out of myself. What's going on? Yeah. And then my girl can't have all, but I chew, we send paper bill to you send people bill to you online. I say, listen, it's a cut off today. It's not $1 more you're getting from us. Amen. Everybody say hallelujah. No mercy. No, you don't understand that. We suffer too much. Not all. We don't let nobody, when God bless us, them come take and rob us. Amen. So everybody say hallelujah. It's our time now. Everybody says it's our time. It's our time. Now, the Bible said, the only thing don't change, it no matter what people do in it, what they don't know is that the only thing don't change is God's character and his holiness. The Bible said there is a time and season for everything under the sun. The hurt to change right now. Everything change. But people don't know God's character don't change. So what the enemy didn't know is that Joseph time was coming. Daniel time was coming. Everybody point by yourself and call your name. Apostle Steve to list on time coming. Hold on. Call your full name. You remember what we teach Saturday? So Wednesday? The Lord, so when you pray, I pray for anybody who doesn't say Apostle or Janice, call the full name because it means something. Everybody do it again. It says, it's Apostle Steve time now. It's your time now. Point by yourself. My time now. Everybody said that. My time. My time. Restoration time. Your time. Everybody say hallelujah. Amen. We're changing from glory to glory. Everybody say glory to glory. glory, to glory. So God said he's moving us from glory to glory. When you look at the definition of change, it means different. Everybody say I'm different. Look, say it again. So some people believe they have your path. Sometimes you're in the spirit. I know a pastor move. Eh? I'm of a soft heart. I can go there and mess up and just come back in and rub me down. Sorry for me and cry. <laughs> say, eh? God said no prisoner this season. And come back next year. Eh? No prisoner. Eh? So sometimes the enemy try to they know your emotions and then say, me have your path. We know how you, you think. We know what you will do, so I will do you anything. But say everybody say, I'm different. I'm different. Uh, so, amen. So, they're going to come back. When, they, when the enemy come back, put on devil or whatever, they're going to see a different person. Because you're not at the place anymore. Say, you're not. Everybody say, I'm not at the place. I have gone higher. I am different. Different. No. Look at it, it's a change mean different. It's a different set. The next thing I see when it's a change, it's a shift change. You don't understand. Everybody says shift change. 
So all who are on their shift and abuse their power is my shift now. Everybody say hallelujah. It's my shift now. It's I'm going to work now. Everybody say hallelujah. Give me a bell. You ever hear when the bell ring? Yeah. Eh? Yeah. You ever hear when school going to go close? Eh? Yeah. Now, this bell going to ring going to be the end of the enemy. But it's our shift. Eh? Give me a bell. It says my shift. Come on. That don't sound like a bell, man. Give me a bell. It's my shift. Everybody says my shift. My time. My time. My time. My time. Yeah, so, so change mean shift change. You know, you know, one, one set coming off, 12, one set going on. It's our time now. All who in there and the shift before. Eh? Yeah, sorry for Vashti and in crew, them and him, and as I call them. It's our time. Everybody says it's our time. Our time. Amen? You see, Vashti and him and all of them believe, you know, they were unmovable. You, you realize? But what they didn't know, Sister General, is that sometime in the king palace you have some little people who look like idiot. But you never know who the little people they know and what they watch. Amen. God always have a person in there. Amen. 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 So Iman believe that he run things down. in father, he have him seal, him have this. He have Vashti and all of them. But they didn't know that their shift was coming to an end. And the very rope. That then set for you is about to hang them. So everybody say hallelujah. The king's heart is about to change. Because sometimes some light help on you. Not true. But the king deeply know inside her that something not right. Amen. But God troubling some king now. Amen. Amen is about to hang. Come on say amen. Is about to hang. The same rope. That they set for you, they're about to be catching that rope. Everybody say, Hallelujah! 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 Now it said, Change mean balance. Receive when the amount given is more than the amount purchased. You know, we purchase some stuff and they rob us. I say, Go, they don't give us back our due change and our due reward but it's coming everybody says it's coming. it's coming change also mean kinds of low value put on other clothes when the lord said change you know it's a spiritual and natural stuff he changed our garment naturally and he changed our garment spiritually so when god say a change if you could see in the spirit you see all of you putting on new garment everybody say hallelujah, hallelujah. it said that mean the devil that was attacking you when he come back is a different garment he's going to see into. With higher authority. Change mean leave one vehicle and board leave one vehicle and board another vehicle. If I see so somebody and drive and then just come out and move into the next one. So the enemy looking for you in that vehicle. You hint to another vehicle. The enemy looking for you into that position. Stand on your knees. Stand on your feet. You're into that position. So everybody say, change has come. Change has come. It's my shift now. My time now. My shift now. My time now. My shift. My time. My shift. My time. Do you believe? Do you believe? I don't know about you. But for all that the enemy has robbed me, it's coming back. Everybody says it's coming back. All God was doing was arresting some of you. You know, see, I got arrest you at home. Give you time from work. Beautify you. Not you? Show you that the world is bigger than work. Make you see wider sting, wider scope, wider imagination. God rest in you. But when the bell ring, you're going to hear your name call. It's time to step up. It's time. And when you step up, nobody not going to move you. You're going to take dominion. You're going to take the rim. You're going to take position. It's my time now. And my time. 
My time. My time. My time. Change is coming. Now all of us, we're going to declare this. So Heavenly Father, Heavenly Father help, us, Lord, help us, Lord, to follow your leading, follow your leading. Daily. daily. Help us, help us to, understand to understand times, times. Season. season, making the right choice, the right, choice. The right time, the right, the right season. The right season. Let, me Let me be a person, a person. Of, change. of change. Lord, Lord. this is my time. This is my season. Teach me, Lord, the right tactics and strategy. When to move. When to act. When to speak. What to do. What to wear. How to behave. Lord, it's my time. My season. Anoint me, Lord, to be sensitive to the Holy Spirit. Anoint me, Lord. To be obedience to so the Holy Spirit. It's my time. My season. Hallelujah. Do you believe? Do you believe? Do you believe that the decree has made? Do you believe? Say so it's my time. My season. Tuesday coming. We're not going to eat anything after six. We're going to circle the score with some devil that's troubling you. We're going to shut some lion mouth. We're going to turn some lion around. The same lion that they was going to kill us is going to turn around and hit your enemy. Come on. The same lion. The same thing. The devil always wants to use destroy you. It's the very thing God used and destroy him. Everybody say hallelujah. 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 It's my time. Lift your hand. Lift your hand. If you have a key, lift your key in the air. Key mean access and power. Ensure that you get a copy of that tape. Make certain people get it. Amen. There's something with that tape. Amen. Lift your key. It means access. Hallelujah. It means change. It means deliverance. Key, lift your key and say it's my time. My time, my time Lord. My time. Come on, open, come on, open door. Come on. My time. Access. Access. Come on. Access. Come on. Everyone inside here. Jobs. I'm speaking jobs. I'm speaking favor. Everyone that listening to me right now, whether on the internet, if you don't have a job, send out application. I speak. Come on. Door open. Says so my time. If God have to fire some people, they're going to fire their shift are over. Come on. It's my time. It's my time. My season. Hallelujah. It's my time. My season. Come on. Say power. 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 It's my time. My season. My change. 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 The Lord said, be sensitive to his Holy Spirit this week. Because he's going to speak to you about some stuff. He's going to tell you who to call, what to do, what to do, what to do. Because God's going to listen, bless him, so keep your ears down. Amen. Because you're going to hear some stuff. Everybody say hallelujah. We thank you, Holy Spirit. Most high God. Hallelujah. So the word changes for you because change is coming for you. Change is coming for your daughter. Change is coming for your household. As you obey me, said God, watch what I shall do for you. Because I'm the Lord God that I've been speaking to you. I shall give you a job that you didn't expect. And I shall restore you as you obey me, said God. Lord said, listen to me very keenly in this season. Listen to the instruction that I will say to you. And as you obey me, I shall turn around your situation. For the conqueror worm has eaten, the palmer worm, 
Lord said, yes, I shall restore it. Month of June, as you cry out to me, I shall do a new thing in your life. The Lord said, worship me daily. I'm about to use your daughter, said God. And I'm about to restore some things in your life. But you just hold on and say hallelujah. Just say hallelujah. Father, yes, continue. The Lord said, I love you everlasting. He said, my hands is upon this family. I will protect you from death. I will protect you from danger. Both of you should die already. Because the enemy has been petitioning for your life. Well, the Lord said, I shall turn and you shall experience change. And you shall be a testimony because there are many testimonies you have. As you obey me, you shall preach my word again and you shall preach it in this season. And you shall tell many of the death door experience that you have been through. And I have bring you back because I have loved you my daughter. And I bring also protect your daughter because there was a contract to take her out. But the Lord said, uh, let's bring both of them to the wall. There is no turning back for you. You have a job to do. Hallelujah. You cannot turn back. It doesn't matter. And the Lord said, you are walking on a path. You cannot look to the left nor the right. Because I've seen some enemy at the two sides. And it's like they have, you know, those arrows that they, they would fire. And they are saying, if you go to the left or to the right, they will kill you. Amen? Because of your purpose. There's a prophetic mantle upon you. And God said you shall prophesy. You shall sing. And you shall declare my word. Said God. Hallelujah. The Lord said I shall use you. There are some people that God is going to start to give you a dream and vision. You're going to call them. You're going to warn them. Because I've seen that the enemy wants to take out some of your friends. That is why God is pulling you away. God said yesterday is gone. The enemy will want to come and to pull you back. But the Lord said if you go back, you're not going to make it back. So there is no way back you can go. You are going forward. Everybody just stretch your hand to them. Lord heal. Hallelujah. Heal this family. We bless your name. We glorify you. Magnify. Let's put your hand on our shoulder. I told him, shoulder. Lord, I speak healing. Hallelujah. Let your healing virtue be upon them. Lord, let there be a new anointing. Yes, speak your language. Because as you speak, he's speaking to you. Shout hallelujah. Same time, loud. Lord want to feel you. Lord want to feel you. Shout again. Shout again. Lord touch her. Heal her. Shout it louder. You want to feel you. God gonna do a quick word. Louder. Yes, louder. 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 Break, Lord. Yes, fill up. Lord of power, yes. Yes, yes, that's it. Yes, another Satan. Seek your language. Yes. Yes, another Satan, another Satan. Yes. Fire. Fire. Fire, 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 fire. Fire. Fire, yes, Lord. Fire, yes. Let, let go on. Yes, Lord, Lord, fire, baptize her with fire and use her. Use her. Yes, Lord, 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 
Come on, worship him. There's anointing to break shackles. Stand. We invite you. We invite you. If you are. I don't know about Satan. The Lord says, I have a work for you. You know about Satan. I shout hallelujah. The Lord said, I have a work for you. The Lord said, I have a work for you. And he's turning around some situation in your life. Yes, he's turning around. Yes, he's turning around. He's turning around. But your sister, look at life. He's turning. Look at me. God said, I'm turning around some situation in your life. Next six weeks. There's something new going to happen. Worship him. Praise him. Don't shout hallelujah. Come on. The Lord said he wanted to dance. Get your dance clothes here. Yeah? Because God is going to use your might. The Lord said dance. Don't stand up. God said you are full of talent. God said he wanted to dance. And he wanted to be on the praise team. Hallelujah. The trier. Right? Come on. Give me some oil. Yes. God delivered her. Hallelujah. Shout hallelujah. He's ready for you. It's not me. God ready for you to use you big time. The enemy won't kill you, but he can't kill you. Because God called you. If you are, shout hallelujah. Come on. Lord. Shabbat come on, Satan. Every gifts in her will come forth. Anoint her to sing. Hallelujah. To dance. To prophesy. She's a healer. Touch her ears. Anoint her ears. You shall hear God loud and clear. Because God said, my hands is upon you, my daughter. I have called you from before you're in your mother's womb. You belong to me. I love you. I will protect you. And I'm going to use you. I'm going to bless you with the spirit of excellence. You shall receive a... Bring her, bring her, bring her, bring her. Ace. Ace, I, the Lord, shall do a new thing in you. You cannot be normal. You cannot mix. Because I, God, shall use you. I shall use you. Yes, Arakatanakasata. Yes. Give me the eye. Anoint you this day. Many shall say, Where are you from? Shilalakasata. Lord, I release the prophetic. Anointing and all. Yes. Raka sata kasata robo robo sata. E robo robo soko robo koro robo sata. Under the bas soko robo koro robo sata. Come everybody, understand. Worship. There's anointing. 